Hi everyone, today in front of me I have this uh, Samsung Galaxy Tab A8 2021 and I wanted to share the best settings uh, that you can change with you guys. So first of all, let's go ahead and open up the settings app. Here, look for display. And here we have the following settings. So uh, we can either switch between uh, light and dark theme, which is pretty standard feature to have on pretty much all the devices. There is also dark mode. Uh, there are also dark mode settings which allow you to uh, automatically enable the dark mode according to the schedule that you will set up. You can regulate the brightness level of your device or enable or respectively disable the adaptive brightness feature which will um, alter the brightness of your screen, of your display automatically according to the ambient lighting uh, around you. Also, there is this cool uh, eye comfort chill function, which filters on, uh, filters out the blue light and makes the colors way warmer, uh, which is basically a very cool feature that prevents uh, the eye fatigue. So if you feel like your eyes are tired, you just go ahead and enable this function. You can also change the font size, increase it or de respectively decrease it. I'll just put it at the default state. Uh, there is also an opportunity to change the font style, as I said, and make the bold, uh, the font bold. It will look just like that. So moving on to the next feature, which is the screen zoom. So tap on this category. Uh, it basically just increases the visuals uh, on your display, just like that. I'll go ahead and uh, set it back to the default. Uh, Next setting that we have is a screen timeout, uh, which basically is the time after which uh, the screen will turn itself off. So it regulates uh, the idle status of screen, should I say. And here we are presented with the values starting from 15 seconds to 30 minutes. So choose uh, what value is the best for you. Uh, moving on to the next feature, which is a pretty cool feature called Edge Panel. So once enabled, you have this uh, gray bar. On by, by the default, it is located on the right side of your screen. You can just uh, open it. And here you have the quick access to some uh, apps that are most important to you. In order to customize and configure this Edge Panel, you just gotta tap on these three gray lines. Uh, tap on edit and here just you are able to remove or add some apps. I'll add my files and settings for example. And after that just get back to the page you were previously at. And as you can see the my files and setting, uh, settings app have been successfully added. In order to close the edge panel just swipe right. In order to open it swipe left. So moving on to the next uh, setting that allows us to configure what uh, navigation type we would like to use with our tablet. So uh, here Samsung offers us two navigation types. Uh, the first one is buttons. Uh, it is enabled right now. You can see on the bottom of your screen there are three uh, digital buttons. So this one opens the recent uh, app menu. This, this one gets us back to the home screen and the last button allows us to go to the previous page. You can change their order if you'd like or the button position, so we can either put them in left or right, or I'll just stick with the center position. Also, there is the second navigation type, which allows you to navigate through your tablet via gesture. So let me show it to you real quick. As you can see, this little digital buttons on the button have disappeared. And now in order to navigate your device, you just gotta swipe upward swiftly to get back to the home screen. Uh, drag slowly and stop in order to access the recent menu and in order to get back to the previous page just swipe right anywhere on the screen so just like that on the edge I would say not anywhere and we are moving on to the next few display settings that this device have uh, which is screensaver basically just uh, turns off the screen uh, automatically once your tablet is charging you can set it to the colors mode so your screen will look just like that or uh,
start showing some photos from your, from your gallery. And there are also the visibility enhancement for your display, which has all kinds of settings, which allows you to uh, enable the high contrast fonts, high contrast keyboard, highlight buttons, uh, turn on the color inversion, um, remove some animations in order to increase the um, performance of your tablet and in order to save some of the live battery and all other kinds of features. But that was it, that was it for the display settings. Hope you liked the video. Thank you so much for watching and bye-bye.